Well, hello everyone. All right, so the current time is 514, and I am leaving Grandma Jean's house to head to Madison's house so we can head up to Columbia. It is Friday the 15th? I don't know, Friday, I'm gonna say Friday the 15th. It probably is the 16th, I don't know. It's, but it, it is Friday before we leave. We leave tomorrow, and I am super excited about it. My bag's packed and I have pictures of how well I packed my bag. It probably won't stay like that and it probably won't return home looking like that, but it looks nice leaving out. And uh, I'm excited, you know, this is my first adventure with my wonderful and loving girlfriend who I love so much. And um, we are going to the country that she can speak fluent in. I've had a lot of people ask, you know, why Germany? Why not France or Italy or Russia? you know, where you're from. And the reason that is, is because I don't speak any of those languages. And my girlfriend, she speaks just about fluent German. You know, I'm gonna give her the credit and say that she speaks fluent German. Um, and so we are going to go to Germany. So I don't need to, you know, have a translator. And I'm really excited about it. So what's next? Uh, well, what's next is we are going to leave from here and go to Columbia and stay with my extended family, Logan Baxley, Amber Brooks. I almost said Amber Baxley, but it's not Brooks, and Ray Brooks. Um, they have been kind enough to allow us to stay with them for the night before we uh, leave their house early tomorrow morning to go to the airport. So this is my first entry on my trip to Germany can't wait to tell you guys all about it and I'm excited. Bye. So I'm gonna get my first sticker. Yeah, it says Delta Security so it depends on. We're flying with Delta. Okay, well, there you go. Wow. I went to go check in online today because it sent me a notification saying um, your flight leaves this time tomorrow at gate A1. And it said we could upgrade seats for $35. You didn't upgrade their seats, did you? No. Okay. <laughs> well, I, I was about to say. No. I was like, because that's connected to my bank account. No, no. I didn't feel like getting the decline sign put up in my face. Uh, just kidding. Anyway. Okay. We're not talking about your bank account. We're talking about mine. Psst. Smile. Thank you. Maybe a few people to die. Um. I'm with Blake. What's up, guys? Okay, my bad. Yeah, sound like that. Um. So we are in the Bello freaking lot getting ready to head to Columbia. Um, we're gonna be spending the night at a friend's house and then tomorrow morning we are heading to the Charlotte airport to fly to Germany, which is, I can't, I can't wait. Um, so the whole itinerary for the flights basically is we're flying from Charlotte to where? Atlanta. Oh yeah, okay. Charlotte to Atlanta, then there's like a five hour layover. Then we're going from Atlanta to Munich. We're gonna spend three days there. Then we're taking a train, which is like eight hours long, wasn't it? Yeah, it was something like yeah, that. Yeah, it was like an eight hour long train ride to Frankfurt. And then spending three days in Frankfurt. Yep. And on the fourth day, we're flying home. Yeah, and then on the fourth day, we're flying out from Frankfurt and we're gonna go to Amsterdam flying from it's like an hour late over there from Amsterdam to Detroit Michigan and then from Detroit back to Charlotte and then the worst part of this whole trip is gonna be driving from back from Charlotte because then our trips over to not only that, I'm going to be tired. <laughs> oh, I'll drive back. I'm not worried about that. But 
I'm super excited and I'm gonna take y'all on the journey with me. I don't video a lot, but I'm gonna try to incorporate this whole trip into it. I'm gonna take a lot of pictures. I got a new tripod, so I'm excited to use it. And we're gonna be visiting some castles. Um, he, um, Blake wanted to really do a concentration camp visit or tour. So we're gonna do that. Um, I wanted to do a castle tour of the castle that Sleeping Beauty is based off of, which I'm super excited about. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. I just wanted to do that. I want to So the current time is 9.52. Uh, we have just basically gotten to the outskirts of Columbia and uh, we're tired. We, I would say we're hungry, but we got snacks, didn't we? Damn. Yeah, we got snacks. We got boiled peanuts, uh, some beef jerky, and um, some drinks because I had to pee and my bladder and my mind were not going to uh, just settle down for a little bit but we are um, just about to get to Logan's house we're gonna have a little bit of food maybe have a drink or two and then we're going to um, go to bed because we've agreed to leave by six o'clock tomorrow 5 30 I stand corrected and because um, we have an hour and a half drive to Charlotte and then our plane leaves at basically 11 o'clock, but we're not going to take our chances because who knows what Charlotte's like. My only experience with airports is Charleston, and that's atrocious. But I um, hope everybody has a good night, and we can't wait to see you tomorrow. Bye. Well, good morning, everyone. So, oh, my bad. Current time is six o'clock in the morning. My, well, Madison's alarm has been going off since 5.15. We are headed to Charlotte to get on our first plane going to Atlanta. This video isn't going to be very long. It's going to be very short because I'm tired, but we are excited. Um, we got to go get our coffee because some people get hangry when they don't have their coffee, and that's me. Uh, we had a good time last night, though. We uh, hung out with Logan, and we played a game. We took a few shots, and um, it was, I, I can honestly say I had a very mature and honest, fun time in Columbia. Uh, thank you, Ray and Amber, for allowing us to stay with you and sharing your alcohol and um, just laughing at uh, things that I cannot repeat uh, because I can't use the excuse that I'm intoxicated. Of course, I'm not going to add that to my Germany video, but um, I, am, I am truly grateful to have friends and extended family like them. Madison, do you want to add anything? No, you don't, want, you don't even want to say good morning to everybody? No? See, she's uh, she's not awake yet. And somehow she's behind the steering wheel. But uh, we will keep you guys updated. And uh, can't wait to tell you guys about Germany. Alright. Good morning and goodbye.
about an hour and a half of driving, Madison saved us um, a good chunk of money by parking at Days Inn Hotel. And uh, they have a shuttle that will be taking us to the airport at 8 o'clock. Um, what I'm doing right now is I'm putting in our um, parking pass so that we can uh, park here and not worry about too much. So, um, getting more and more nervous, worried about, you know, what possibly could go wrong. But, hopefully, everything will go just as planned. And, um, I'm, I'm really excited about it. She is currently using the restroom. And I am about to have to do it myself. So... I hope everyone is having a wonderful day, and I can't wait to see you guys when I get back. So, it's the end of our first day in Munich, Germany. We are currently laying in our hotel, which is very comfortable, very nice. Um, we 
Just finished dinner at, how do you say it, Madison? Hofbrau House. Hofbrau House, which is a beer hall. Um, service was absolutely terrible because um, we had no clue that you had to basically wave down the waiters to order anything. Um, but we had a wonderful dinner and an amazing beer that I can't stop thinking about for some reason. And I don't usually drink beer. Uh, we walked around downtown Munich. Uh, we saw the festival. What was the festival again? Madison? I can't remember. Film festival? It was a film festival of some sort. But it was very interesting. Um, we talked to our family. And between the times of 3 p.m. here and 9 p.m. here, we slept. Which would be 9 a.m. there to 3 p.m. there. Um, just because of the terrible jet lag that we felt, or at least I felt, Madison was perfect in every way. Don't you agree, Madison? Yeah, I'm a little tired. A little but tired, so. Not too bad. But we um, had an amazing time, and um, I think the best part of our trip so far was that Madison brought Herbal Life stuff, and it spilled in her suitcase. <laughs> So I spent about five minutes dumping out her suitcase and shaking off all of her clothes. And then I um, took a shower, and our shower was amazing, um, believe it or not. Um, they don't have hot water like we do. It's almost like it's well water. So it's if you use all the hot water, you're out of hot water type of situation. That was interesting. But we, um, we had an amazing time for our first day, and tomorrow we're going to... Wake up bright and early and um, enjoy it. Um, I don't think I added this in the video, but the current time is 12.42. And morning. it is tomorrow morning. So let's get some sleep and uh, start fresh tomorrow. All right, love you guys. All right, well, good morning, people of America. We slept until 12 o'clock today. I'm going to say jet lag. Madison could probably say laziness. Hey. <laughs> come here, come here. So, anyways, we have decided to go shopping and go to the lake today. You know, fun stuff. We only have, like... 12 hours to do all that though so the video is going to be short also because Madison likes to hog the phone charger as you can see off to the left of her so my phone's about to die <laughs> but we are um we got exciting things to do today and we'll keep you guys updated do you want to say anything no no well love you bye
So it's 9.47 in Munich, Germany, and we are currently watching what the nightlife looks like here.
currently walking to a bridge above the castle, which means we're walking uphill. Isn't that right? You not wear clothes for this. <laughs> See, she said she was a princess, so I guess she thought I was going to carry her up the hill, which I would if I wasn't so tired. Tell everybody you love them. Uh, hi, I love y'all. Bye, guys. Wow, look at you ruining my video. Let me take the video. What? I'll take the video because you have cards and it's making me nervous. Well, come on, bud. Okay, so we uh, we got to that bridge, and we realized that was a final destination type moment uh, with uh, probably about a hundred people on a bridge trying to take a picture. Well, I stepped on a board, it started wobbling, and I told myself, no way. So I took a picture of the castle, and I got off like a smart person. Hiking up the, uh, the side to the castle. Mazin stopping everywhere. Taking pictures of this beautiful thing. Look at that. So we just saw the castle. I'll let Mazin tell you how she feels about it. Oh, I'm tired. Come on, just tell, tell them a little bit. It was gorgeous. It was? Yeah, it was huge. And it's right there. And it's right there. It was beautiful. It really was. We weren't allowed to take pictures though, which was saddening, but it's all right. Now we are walking downhill. Both of our feet are hurting. And uh, we just, we want something to eat because it's hot outside and um, nobody takes debit cards here and all I got is 10 and it's either we get food with it or we get something like a ride here with it so we're um, we're going to keep walking and get a ride back to where we're going <laughs> Guys, look. They have a peak hole for when people are using the toilet. Ew, you didn't flush. Yes, I did. <laughs> I love you.
guys it is um, 308 Thursday the 20th uh, we just left the museum after it decided to rain for about five minutes or so um, but we got to see some really cool things uh, we got to see some dinosaur bones some animal bones we got to see Lucy and um, if you don't know who Lucy is, then ask Logan, because Logan will tell you all about it. I don't know anything about Lucy. All I know is that she is uh, famous, and uh, that is not Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. Ha! Huh? Beatles joke. So, anyways, we are walking, and um, so my first impressions of Frankfurt was uh, we got on a train in Munich, went to Frankfurt, got off the train, and ended up in New Jersey. Because, I mean, look at this place. It's not terrible I mean but it's it's skyscrapers and everything so I was uh not gonna lie I miss Munich I miss the uh, touristy comfort and not feeling like I'm in downtown um, Columbia or New York or worse I miss Munich. <laughs> we all miss Munich but uh, pollen is everywhere uh, the air smells like pollen and, um, oh, funny story. So last night, Madison and I were walking around um, after we had sushi. We decided to take the long way back to our hotel, which was uh, deep regret. We walked down the street and on both sides are um, um, gentlemen bars. And um, there was a, what looked like a piece of artwork in the ground. And I thought to myself, I was like, wonder what that guy's doing because he's just standing in it and Madison's like those are public urinals just so you know and I was like I miss Munich at that point <laughs> I didn't realize that um Frankfurt is um yeah, so not for can, tourists and you can literally stand it's like a grate and it has this metal basically a wall around you but the wall is not completely enclosed behind you so everyone can see what you're doing behind you and they're basically just open public urinals, so you can just go in there, guys can just pee, and Exhibit, and she's on a mission to see her hippo. Madison, where are we going? See are you sure? Yeah. You're 100%. Time's time in. Where are you? Are you 
Messen. Come here. Just watch your face. Then what's that? It's her favorite animal, guys. After two minutes and 25 seconds of searching, we found her favorite animal. Look. <laughs> oh. Look how close you can get it's to so it. It's so fat. <laughs> Look how close you can get to it. So the current time here is 4.22 a.m. Germany time. It's roughly 10.22 over where you guys are. Mess and I packed up everything. We got to bed last night at like 12, 12.30 last night. Madison, say hello to everybody. And we are headed home. Can't wait to see you guys. Love you guys. Alright guys, so we are currently in Detroit um, after a nine hour flight, seven hour flight, not nine because we still have another two hours to fly from Detroit to Charlotte. Uh, we are walking to our gate and we are tired, um, we're ready to be home, we're ready to not have to worry about anything else. Say something. Say something to our friends and family. You want to say that you love and you're happy to be home? Not home yet. Well, we're almost home. I love you guys. We're finally back home in 
Charlotte. Good morning, guys. So, it is... I don't even know what time it is, but it's early in the morning. We got home last night at 11.45. Uh, oh, okay. We got home at like 11.30. And I've been up since 4 a.m. Thank you, jet lag. Your gift to me is not accepted, but will be received. Um, I had an amazing time in Germany. And I've made memories that I won't be able to ever forget. I came home and my grandmother was waiting for me. It was an amazing feeling. And I, I'm happy to be home. My bed's so much more comfier now than it was before. And my family's coming over at like 10 o'clock. <sighs> Which is exciting, because I love my family. But Germany was an experience that I'll never be able to forget. And I was thankful to be able to experience with a woman who I will love and cherish for the rest of my life. And I can't wait to see what my future holds for me. I've enjoyed making these videos and taking the pictures and sharing this trip with you guys but this is my final video for my trip to Germany and as they say in German this is why Madison came with me because I can't even speak German see you later